With Rogue One just a few days away, and with a lot of people already seeing the film, I wanted to put out my death predictions, as I do for every Star Wars movie, and for a lot of us, we can come back in less than 24 hours and check, myself included, and judge how accurate my predictions were. Take into account for this death predictions video, I will be using existing news that we have about the film, but as of this point, I have completely stayed away from spoilers, with the exception of a slip up during celebration this year. Before we start though, I would like to thank the sponsor of this video, Geek Fuel. I don't usually do promotions on my channel unless I think it's a product I like and I think many of you guys would like as well. Geek Fuel is a subscription based company who gives out monthly mystery boxes including shirts, comics, and toys, all awesome and all geek related. If you go into the description, you can find a link headed to their website for more info, and if you do use the link below, in your first box you will receive a top secret exclusive Star Wars item that I'm even curious to learn more about. If you can find the time and are interested, I would really appreciate you checking them out. Like I said, I only try to promote products I believe many of you might enjoy and that I enjoy myself. Again, using the link below in your first box, you will receive an exclusive Star Wars item worth $30 absolutely free. If you do end up getting Geek Fuel, be sure to tell me what you get in your first box in the comment section of any of my videos. Anyway, with that said, let's begin with my Rogue One death predictions. Jin Erso. Although Jin is our lead for the film, her fate is still largely up in the air at this point. We do know obviously she is not in the original trilogy, however, I do not think Jin will die. Before she joined to steal the plans to the Death Star, she had little to no part in the rebellion, and I believe after completing her mission she will depart again despite there still being a war going on. I can see Jin going off to a smaller section of the rebellion and helping there, but as far as dying in Rogue One, I don't believe she will. Cassian Andor. Cassian is a very tough pick. We know he has been a key part of the rebellion for some time, and that he has recruited tons of members to the cause, so his absence is felt in the OT. Cassian is someone we know not only has deep ties to the rebellion, but key players within the rebellion, like Mon Mothma, so I will say Cassian will meet his fate in Rogue One, purely based that he does not appear in the original trilogy. Chirrut. For Chiru, I need to put a spoiler warning for those who have not seen the film, as his fate was accidentally revealed at Celebration this year. I'll go ahead and give you guys a few seconds. At Celebration, the actor who plays Baze Malbus accidentally revealed Chiru does in fact die in the film after a double cross by Baze is revealed. He then went on to say that after that occurs, he does something really heroic to save the rest of the group. K2. The droid K2SO is slowly becoming everyone's favorite character for the film, but sadly, I do believe he will be killed in the movie. I see K2 going out as a hero protecting others, sacrificing himself in a final act for his friend, Kazian. The main reason I say this is because Kazian freed K2, and because of that, he is completely loyal to him. I believe at one point, Kazian will come into great danger, and K2 will step in, dying in the process. Baze Malbus. Again, there will be spoilers for this character based off of comments made at Celebration this year. One more time, a few more seconds. The fate of this character was revealed that he sacrifices himself after Chura is killed in battle, so his death was pretty much revealed before even seeing the film. Bohi Rook. Bohi Rook is another tough character to pin down. I like the idea of a defector from the Empire who chooses a different path, and I think that might result in him ultimately living and continuing on in the Rebellion, expressing how the Empire affected those working under it and how it oppressed them, as well as the Rebels or other individuals not a part of Imperial ranks, so ultimately, I will predict that Bohi lives. Galen Erso. I do believe heavily Galen Erso will die. As a character that has a large part in creating the Death Star, I don't see him making it out of this film. I also don't believe Galen will make it to the end of the film, and his death will be the thing that pushes Jin to fully commit to stealing the plans and aiding the rebellion. Although Galen is not a bad man, he does in some way have to pay for what he's created. Director Orson Krennic I feel out of all the characters, Krennic's fate is by far the most obvious. Of course, Krennic is not in the original trilogy, but as the man behind the overseeing of the construction of the Death Star, it is extremely odd he is not in at least A New Hope. We do know Tarkin took over the Death Star, so it does make sense that Krennic would die and Tarkin would take over following his death. As of how, I would not be surprised if Vader kills him after learning of his failure, or if Jin kills him. Of course, Krennic being the main antagonist, I suspect he won't die until the very end, but I do think he will die. Now for big surprises I think may pop up in the film. I have heard rumors we could see Leia and Tarkin, but if I had to guess, I would say Tarkin is more likely of the two. I know Leia does have the plans in the first film, but Tarkin to me seems a bit more appropriate. 
As for seeing Rebels TV characters, I find this to be highly unlikely, but that doesn't mean we won't get some type of reference to the crew of the Ghost, or maybe see one of them in the background. So those are my death predictions for Rogue One. I am seeing the film on Friday, and I am very excited. So far I've heard good things, of course staying away from spoilers. If you have seen Rogue One and you want to discuss it in the comments, feel free to, but be sure to put a spoiler tag, as not everyone has had the opportunity to yet. If you haven't seen the film yet, and you would like to put your own death predictions in the comments, I would love to read them. Once again, thank you to the sponsor of this video, Geek Fuel, and if you guys have the time, be sure to check the link below, as I think it's a product a lot of you might enjoy. If you could leave a like, I would really appreciate it, as it helps the channel out a great deal. If you would like to interact with me directly, my Twitter is at StupendousWave. Thanks again as always for watching, may the force be with you, and have a great day.